Hey everybody, got a special treat for you today. We have our Springfield Armory M1 Grand and we have the infamous Black Tip M2 AP. This is actually FN Manufacture 68. We're going to do 49 feet. We have our Armorware Level 4 plate that we're going to test against. We have that one corner that could take another shot. We're going to see what it's going to do. So let's get set up. Here's our clay block prior to shooting. We're right around 85, 86 degrees in the core, which should be good. We left our dimple there from the 400 yard shot with the 338 rum. Plate temperature is just right around 80 degrees. We left it in the cooler with the clay. So we've got our M2 AP. Again, we're at 49 feet. It's about 30 degrees outside today. We'll try to get a chrono reading off this. I got two shots before at 26 to 2700 out of these. Twenty-seven, twenty-one, twenty-six, oh four. 26, 04. Going for the lower left of the plate. Let's go take a look at that. So here's our plate. There is our impact from the M2AP. I don't see a pass through there, folks. Unfortunately, the rest of the plate is pretty much no longer there. A couple of the pieces are on the ground there. But it stopped it. It's an indent there. Give me a second and we'll. Uh, pull it off and check out the back face. So let's get out our tool and check out our measurement here. Try to get a flat spot here. So we're at 21.72 millimeters. At 49 feet, that's amazing. The NIJ standard I do believe is 49 feet. The plate was already compromised from the 400 yard shot with a 338 rum but still it stopped the industry standard round used for qualifying level four. We'll get a closer look at the plate when we get back home, so let's head back that way. So we're back at the house. I just figured I'd show you the plate up close. We had good light so you could see everything. Our impact was right there. Cool how it spiders out all that ceramic right there. When it impacts, it digs it into this fiber here. Right here is part of the steel core. Let me see if I can pull that out. It's embedded in there pretty good. There's part of it anyways. It's part of that molly manganese steel core. It broke most of this ceramic apart. The fibrous backing is still in one piece in most of the area. This area is still may be good for another shot, I don't know. The back side, the foam backing there, it's missing from where it dented it and it's the little shock waves there. So there you have it. Very impressive that this plate already compromised with that 400 yard shot, still took a shot from the industry standard level 4 testing of 30-06 M2AP. Again, Thanks to Armorware for providing this plate. If you guys want to see anything else, let me know and we'll see if we can get more plates from them. I'd really like to see what a level four would do at four, five, six hundred yards against maybe 50 BMG. It'd probably go through, but it'd be interesting to see what it'd look like. Thanks again for watching everybody. Take it easy.